Hello, it's Carly from Learn English with Carly and thank you for joining me again today. If you haven't done so already, press that subscribe button and please feel free to like and comment on videos. All comments I will reply to personally. Okay, today I would like to look at five common mispronounced words in English. I've chosen these words as they are firstly words that we use regularly and secondly because they are words that I often notice English language learners mispronouncing or they don't feel confident in saying them. Let's get going. Take a look at this first word. How would you pronounce it? Correct, it's dessert. Dessert. You'll notice here that I'm using IPA, the International Phonetic Alphabet. If you are unsure about understanding and using the IPA, I have pinned some links below in the comment section to this video to help you out. Now I know many native English speakers who spell this word incorrectly. So to help you, dessert has two S's. Think of the word dessert as being sweet and savory. The two S's will help you to learn this word because both sweet and savory begin with the letter S. So there are two S's in dessert. This next one is nearly the same as dessert in its noun form, but it's actually pronounced desert. Desert. A desert is a dry and arid place with little rainfall. Nothing to do with sweet and savory food as in dessert. Can you hear the difference? Dessert. Desert. Now, I know that you can see the word table in our third word today, but we don't actually say the word table when we pronounce this word. How do you pronounce it? Correct, it's vegetable. Vegetable. I've also written this here to show you how I break down the word in Carly's phonetics. Vegetable. Another word where we see the word table but don't actually say the word table is this one. How do you pronounce this word? Correct, it's comfortable. Comfortable. And the opposite is uncomfortable uncomfortable comfortable uncomfortable and finally our fifth word today is this one cloth cloth however how do you pronounce this word clothes clothes pretend you can't see the word cloth within this word because it's clothes can you hear the difference? Cloth, clothes. I like to keep the word families together. So what about this next word? Clothing, clothing. Can you hear the difference with the three words? Cloth, clothes, clothing. And again, cloth clothes, clothing. Okay, that's it for our pronunciation today. Keep repeating these words until you get more comfortable in using them in your everyday English. Thanks for joining me today and I'll see you again soon. Take care, bye.